Well, I'll be hornswoggled. It's really happening. The ascension is real. I've paid my pants off and forget I can see my future. I see what light. I see a foot. Something about a fingernail. I'm feeling people again. This is finally over. Goodbye, cruel world. Seemed pretty elated. Well, I'd, I'd be too if I was stuck in that position for all these years. We're... Hello. Well. Look, it's the loading screen. Long time no see. <laughs> Welcome back to the end is nigh. I found that nice NPC. Thanks for that. Let us now continue. Oh, not there. Overflow. Mega tumors. We got to get this out of the way. Okay. Um, well, I mean, that was a regular tumor up there. That's all said and done. You think there's a secret down there? Well, is it worth all these deaths? Let's find out. Ah! <laughs> get a load of this, huh? Okay, oh, that's, that's a portal. Okay, down we go. Uh, no, you're supposed to latch onto the, the edge. Yes, very, very good. Trebion, down we go. That's, that's a good start. Very nice. And, uh, so there, there's that one. There are going to be more, many more. We only got one this time. What's... Oh! That's another pretty inconspicuous one. Okay. Well, regardless... There's an NPC, too. Think of him. Perhaps, if you have the time. Quite the dangerous little jungle gym we find ourselves in here. I smell you there, Mega Tumor. You reek, dude! Eureka! <laughs> no, but in all seriousness... Oh, jeez, you have to... I, I want to talk to him. It's gonna be annoying to reset this every time. But that is the way she goes. Oh, there we go. That is the intended route. Very nice. Hello, friend. Oh, oh, a cool guy. I wish that I could roll down there in the mire with you, but I'm just too cute and innocent to descend, so I was just hanging up here till I die, I guess. Good on you, little buddy. Hang on. The Ascenders are going to have their, uh... They're gonna have their coming. I've seen some of your brothers. They're having a pretty good time. I'm sure you will be soon to follow suit. Meanwhile, I guess I'll just keep uh, descending, or however the kids say it these days. I wish there was a little bit of a shadow remaining where the tumor used to be, but alas. Oh, I see it. There's some crumbly blocks here. Something I could have never uh, noticed back in the day, I suppose. Even though they're incredibly... Pardon? Also, there's a fish on display, not that he can do anything. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the blackest sheep of all? Hello, fellow outsider. I'm on one of many adventures. It may appear like I'm standing still, but on the inside I'm creating whole worlds. Who needs to actually experience life when you can just imagine a better one? Dude, you're me, but larger. Have a grand day, buddy. We're gonna have to try this again, though. I have to come back here. I mean, they leave you right outside. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be very, very fun. Okay. Middle of the screen, he still missed it. Well. Fourth fourth attempt. Let's go. There we go. That's just silly. Not too dangerous, just very silly. We're supposed to do a frog hopping. Excuse me? It's a lot easier than I was ever making it out to be. No, you don't have to do... Oh, it's the frog hopping. It's frog hopping. Yo, how are you guys doing? You got a... 
I'd like to collect her treasure, if you don't mind. I know you might be very, uh, you know, protective of it. Just a quick little raid. You do nothing more, nothing less. My oh my. Hell incarnate. <laughs> uh, anyways, well. Oh wait, no, there's just a key right here. Easy as pie. Obviously I couldn't have entered this key door at this point in the game. Dude, get around. All right. Bellissimo. There we go. Just don't hop directly into the guy and you'll be good to go. So there's our key, huh? You're gonna put the key there, huh? You see? We got the key in between this little gauntlet. let's see. Okay. Thank you. Now I just have to survive this other portion. Thank you. That's a really fun thing to do. I'm gonna get the key on the way back. Let me practice my shelter in this anterior portion. Posterior portion, sorry. You just gotta do a little bit of dive, it's not that bad. Oh my goodness. What's going on here? What is going on? No! No, you're not gonna make me- no. <laughs> no! No, 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 no. You don't understand, this is not all- this is illegal. It's scary. Oh, heck off. Safety? On. I, uh... Yeah, baby! Alright. Every stage, every every world has its one uh, mega tumor that's just so... unfeasibly impractical to get that you have to ask yourself, why is this here? Why don't they put the cartridge here? That's an award appropriate of such a difficult little, little fun little gauntlet. Use that word too often, maybe. Just pond skipping along. It's the pond scum. Just a friendly little uh, prot protist hanging out in your local waters.
<laughs> I'm safe here. Oh, there's one last little fun obstacle for us, huh? And of course it's still acid water, because why wouldn't it be? Oh, beautiful. Magnifico! Quit to, oh, that's right. Still have to get the key. Thank you. Don't mind if I will get out now? Thanks. What have we? One more. Sort of. I sort of remember how to frogs. There we go. Now we just do it again. Beautiful. Magnificent. <laughs> That's pretty clever. Now, uh... uh Help. Okay. That. Oh, awesome. Guess I'll die. So if they, um... What the heck? <laughs> huh? Pardon? Okay. That's nice. I'm going to uh, embrace the opportunity to fully reset and re-enter that stage, including all these frog jumps. Just gotta survive! Oh yeah, he's done it. I don't think I did elaborate on what the hint was to finding that secret area. Basically, um, even though you can't jump directly upwards from here, probably. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to commit suicide. But notice how this level terminates at this kind of horizontal level. There's pillars implying that there's more up there. Then you come around here, and you notice that it went from being at the top of the screen to being at the bottom of the screen, implying there could be something in the upper left corner. Pretty neat, huh? So if that's every tumor, then riddle me this. What the heck is above here? Is there anything above there? Because it looks like there definitely has to be something, right? I guess the only thing it could really be is a hidden NPC. We're about to find out, maybe, hopefully. Yeah, hey buddy, how you doing? When you are dead, you will envy the pain, the living feel, and will long to experience it again. Even the most horrible memory for an eternity. Pro tip, don't die. I died and look at me now. Good. That's a good pro tip, to be honest. It's not something you could really divine yourself based on common sense or everyday knowledge, you know? It's a bit of a trickier one. Anyways, I don't need to be here anymore. Let's move on then. Uh, Wall of Sorrow? Find some of these early secrets. Keep them coming. Wow. That's a little bit of a precise one, isn't it? And of course he messes this up. <laughs> oh my, you're gonna recede from me. Well, now, how is the boy to get back? Fantastic question, just do that. 
tumor's already been saved. We're good to go. Uh, there's one even earlier, is what you're saying? Well, I did not expect this. Back we go, then. Oh! Oh, you just get extruded out the back, huh? That's a little bit strange. I couldn't get down with that, though. Oh, I'm dead, by the way. <laughs> That's, uh, simple as it is. Simple as it gets. I have no idea what we're doing here. But it looks like it worked. No, it did not work out because you freaking dio dove directly onto those little bad boy spikes. This should be incredibly easy, and it is incredibly easy. Just kind of a little twitchy on the fingers today. To transfer to that hook. You know, it would be advisable to handle that with a little bit more finesse. There we go. There we go. We've successfully remained alive. Now can we get back to the uh, throbbing nodule with the same amount of safety? Fantastic question. Yes, very easy. Gorgeous. That's done. Now, SS Exodus. Hello? Hold on a minute, there is a nook up there. How did I not see that? You silly little boy. Which means you have to risk the uh, pollen puffs that will spawn instantaneously onto your position. Yes. That's some pretty good game design right there. Unless, of course, you memorize the entire pattern of how they spawn, which is definitely a viable choice. Or just bum rush it. That's the way I always like to go. Hang on, hang on, hang, hang on to him. There we go. Ooh, automatically grabbed. I like that. Swoops right in. Hello, Mega Tumor. I can't help but notice that the uh, quantity of tumors we've acquired is a pretty interesting number. Nice to have this many. Really shows how far along in the game we've come, and doesn't have any other significance besides that. You know, these little, uh, Drilling cones. They're quite unique spike images. Why is that never used elsewhere in the game? I love it. It just destroys those little aerated buddies. It kills them to bits. Thoroughly eviscerates them. What? 
That's actually a mega tumor. Pardon? That's a really, really sneaky one, isn't he? Oh, wait. Before before we finalize this. Okay, no, you can't. Uh... Oh, no, you can't. Oh, no, you can't. I'm mostly trying to get a grip and try so I can reach over to that friendly little ghost, because I don't think that's possible. We do not speak of this. There we go. Sorry I'm dead. Just joshing you. That's just something a video game said. You're a video game guy, right? Absolutely, dude. Impressive uh, observational capabilities. Despite your lack of eyes, you were able to fully formulate the true uh, magnitude of my being. I like that in you. I, I, I see great potential in that clairvoyant capability. Well, I mean... So we've gotten 425 now. There is just five mega tumors remaining. And we'll be at the fabled 450. Let's revisit old retrograde here. Been a long time. Oh man, this filter. <laughs> I don't remember it being so silly. Of course. Of course. These are just. So. Is there any reason that there's like an organic variant to the uh, cannon? I remember these guys. I don't know why they're even considered different entities. Like, just put regular cannons there, it's not a big deal. I guess it's more thematic to do this. I don't know if what I'm doing is the correct procedure. Yes, it is. You just had to, you know, go at it hard. Okay. Keep them coming, then. Uh, there's two more. Oh, yes, I remember this stage. Hello. It's as I feared. It's gotta be. <laughs> yep, the weird warp criteria, but it worked out. Oh, that's how you escape. Okay. These teleports are a little finicky, aren't they? Uh, well, what really matters is that... First of all, look at these little tumor particles following me. I never really noticed them until we get to this somewhat annoying filter. That's beautiful, they look like little inverse fireflies. I love it. Anyways, tumor acquired. Looking good, there's only one at the very end somewhere. Doesn't have to be at the very, very end, but it's near the edge. Near the terminus. And it's my duty to find it. There it is. Okay, yeah, key door, of course. The last of our unexplored key doors. Let's do it. I mean, that's a little bit tricky, isn't it? Just having the key kind of retract and expand at will. But hey, if you insist. Now what? So first of all, there's an NPC there. Like, excuse me? keeps coming. Oh, there's a rising block, of course. In the house of the rising block. Oh, it's a limited window. I'll fancy that, huh? We can try it again without dying, thanks to magic. No! How are you, how are you supposed to estimate that timing? Hmm? Please do explain. So you just don't wait at all. Charge on it. Okay. When you know a secret, I find meaning in the absurd. Like, what if there is a reason why you look that way? What if there's a deep reasoning for everything around us? Like, what if this is some code being laid out for us? 
What all we need to do is open our eyes a bit more to see it for what it is. Like what if I'm upside down for a reason? What if it helps me see this world for what it really is? Man, ascenders are weird. We don't live in the Matrix, dude. This is, we're, we're beyond that kind of reasoning. Now, technically, yes, you are in a video game, as someone else did point out, but that that's irrelevant to you. Can we do this? Can we... I move too fast in the air. It's unfathomable. Is there nothing else to do here? No tumor. Henlo. 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 We're gonna have to shimmy around a little bit quicker, I imagine. Oh no, they will grab you instantly. In that little crevice, you can count on that. Oh, you gotta do a quick little wall grab there. Understandable. Zoop. Zooey mama. Time to go to the machine. Retrograde, full cleared. Is that what I think it is up there? But how's a boy to reach that? Yeah, quite the- oh wait, you just do this. Of course, of course. Yeah! Yeah, baby! But first. No, that's- that's not at all what you're supposed to do. Grab this. You do not fast jump! You hook, but then live, which is a whole nother issue <laughs> altogether. Um, okay, n no, you had it correctly, you just don't leap directly into the bullet after you've already achieved safety. I forgot that you can actually live in that little square outside the gun. At least for the microsecond before you uh, receive a bullet to the face. Used to be an adventurer like you, and then I... Well, I'll let you fill in the rest. Wink. Okay. So we got some cannons. We got some switches. Is this supposed to be a challenge? Pish... I, I dodged the bullets with ease, but the spike... The spike... I got myself caught directly in. That's just a little silly, isn't it? Oh, did you see that swift little ninja jump? That's the kind of skill I'm talking about, baby. Oh, no, not quite. So this conveyor belt just only adds weirdness to the equation. These are pacemakers, that's all. Oh, friends, no tumor here. Here is the friendly tumor. Excuse me. Um... Conglomeration. Is there anything I can do to reach you before I peace out? Like, I see some mother over there. Uh... I mean... <laughs> that jump is obviously not possible. I don't like it. I... There's no visible obstacles. And yet they just hover there. It's not like you could... It's, maybe there's another secret area above where they'd be standing? Or perhaps it is some mystery so incomprehensible to us mere mortals. Or perhaps just me rambling here will cause some freaking timed events to happen. I don't think everything, anything in this game has taken this long to um, act... <laughs> oh my. Okay, well. I should have noticed. See, directly below this. Directly below this, you see there's a two tile gap. Way at the bottom of the screen. That there. 
is probably the hint that this thing is rising. You understand? If I was just a little bit more observant. So you think the jump is doable now? Yeah, yeah. We decided to ascend together, but when one of us ascended, the rest of us got curled feet. Now, like you, we are rotting. Rotting eternally from the inside. We tried to push him away, but we have become bonded by time. Hey, sorry to hear that, dude. Yeah, it looks like one of you is definitely dead. That's a shame, that's a damn shame. Can, was there an, a, more of a secret to accomplish back here? I feel like I'm missing out on something. Oh, okay. If you insist. Still, let me reopen the port. Stop this. Let me reopen the porthole. See, you can easily traverse this. And there's stuff to the right now. Yeah, so there's two mega tumors in one entry point. You know, that's fine. Better than having to find two separate entry points, am I right? Or am I right? These are just spikes. These are solely spikes. For what purpose are there pairs of spikes joined at the rear? Is this supposed to make physical sense? Okay. Well, simple enough. And now, of course, we just have this little boy here. Did I see that when I was grabbing a key at one point? Maybe. I just never acted on it. Well, stage five! I've gotten an achievement to stage five. Yay for me. Sadly, there's no cutscene, so I'm not gonna have an epic thumbnail. I'm gonna have to just pick one of these random tumors, I guess. Wow. I mean... That'll do it, then. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I will see you next time with... Whatever happens as we assemble these friendly boys. Until then.